All right, we're going to be running another like all magic team test against the current meta teams, which if they would let me load like that. Good thing to keep an eye out for when you're looking at an opponent is check the HPs and agilities of them. Like right now I can tell he has the wind armor equipped because of his agility and his level, but he doesn't have any HP up him, so he doesn't have a mystic egg. Otherwise his HP would be near 800 with his current level. I look at Zane. He has Alkamono equipped and Gurren Blade. Look at him. He's got. He also has Alkamono and Gurren Blade. So Elemental, I'll do a lot of damage because he doesn't have the extra Teddy defense. The hope here is quickened by Ilya. On Rin, Rin will master ability onto F Yomi. And uh, I believe Naka's first turn will be shield defense buff herself and Ilya. Oh, wait, what? Interesting. I thought she was in range. Hmm, she was in range before. I wonder why. What happened? Did I change my page? Oh no, she'll prioritize damage over... Okay. Now there's defense up. Zane's gonna come by and slaughter everybody if I don't watch out. Look at this guy moving out the way. Like a fucking pro. Actually on that, that one was like, okay, you saw it. You're gonna hit Rin with it? I wonder if I guard where I live. No. Okay. <laughs> Good to know. Wow. Intersecting Thunder was almost instant cast. Oh, because his team is so slow. He's going to move up in Lightbringer. Most likely I die, I believe. Yep. It's all coming down to Neka. He's going to Intersecting Thunder again. He's going to move up, and I believe she'll use Luminous Chant. What? Why didn't you use Luminous Chant? Basically, had she done Luminous Chant there, it was an instant hit. I don't know why she wouldn't do that. It, it would have been death, because it was double light. But, that works out. 